Last year, we caught a glimpse of Lockheed Martin's 30 kilowatt fiber laser weapon system that decimated an engine manifold in a few seconds from more than a mile away. Lockheed has also used Athena to shoot down small rockets, unmanned aerial vehicles, and small boats. Dingies. No, I mean weaponized dinghies. Well, yesterday, Lockheed announced that it has completed the design, development, and demonstration of a 60 kilowatt class beam combined fiber laser. This one has a date with the US Army. The company tested the laser in early March and it produced a single 58 kilowatt beam. The feat is impressive and a little bit scary as it represents a world record for a laser of this type. No photos from the demonstration have been made available yet, though they did provide the snack and rendering. The system has a beam combined fiber laser, which means that it brings together individual lasers generated through fiber optics to generate a single intense laser beam. This means the laser is scalable, but the 58 kilowatt laser actually pushed the physical limits for focusing energy towards a single small spot. I mean, the laser system also proved to be highly efficient in testing, capable of translating more than 43% of the electricity that powered it directly into the actual laser beam it emitted. Lockheed Martin is now preparing to ship the laser system to the US Army, and I just cannot wait to see that footage. I mean, if the 30 put that hole, that fire blazed hole through a truck, what did 60, or like 58, what did 60 do? Show me that truck! I'm David Manti. This is IEN Now.